Jason a, a superb defensive performance a long way to come on a Tuesday night and St James Park is always a tough place to go we found that out in the past a, a really good point yeah I didn't see it coming in the first half I thought we were all over the place um, you, you, well, people can say it was a long journey but we just weren't at the races um, which was disappointing because like you say you've got to have 11 players on top form to play yeah, because they're the top side you know great movement good good quality the lad up front's a real handful um, you know I don't think it was a penalty you know which kills us again we've had two bad decisions um, in two games like I said second half I thought we were excellent I thought our work rate our togetherness and I thought our organisation second half you know we we addressed things at half time we talked about you know like narrowing the pitch and getting further up the pitch as a centre half because the game was you know the game was too the, the, box to box it was too too open you know the first half and and, and we, we condensed the play a little bit more uh, so delighted with the second half performance you know I can't fault the lads today I mean the fans were, were unbelievable I mean we had a full coach down here you know 200 miles 400 miles round trip whatever so a real credit to the supporters who've come they're true supporters you know that's what you call non-league supporters coming here on a Tuesday night um, and just credit the players because like I said they've given us everything tonight um, I said at half time I thought we were below par, I thought we were below par, I thought we, we didn't create a great deal but we could have snatched it at the end, Glenn's had a great header, uh, got up well and, and, and could have snatched it and that would have been the icing on the cake. Would we deserve to win? I don't think we would have, no, um, but like I say, you'd have, you'd have took that up the A1. Yeah, I was going to say, do you, do you think we deserved the three points tonight? But obviously I think Bradley are going to be there or thereabouts at the end of the season, they're always there, this could prove to be a really valuable point. To answer your question, no, I don't think we deserve the three points, like you say, but I think our endeavour um, warranted something. Um, but like you say, they're a good side, top side, uh, move the ball about really well. So any, any team that comes here and gets something has to play well. Um, and we've defended manfully, and that's not just the back four and, and the back five with Gildy, but uh, across the park, you know, I thought that there was some... We, we, had a, we had a tough away game at Alfred on Saturday. Don't get back till nine, ten o'clock on Saturday night and then had to come here on Tuesday night. Um, so... You know, I'd have been de devastated if, the, if they'd have scored late on because I don't think we deserve that neither. Um, I, I think you'd have know, snapped the hands off coming down here for a point and, and like I say, we're going, we're going home quite happy. Not not so much happy with with, with how we pass the ball because I think we can pass the ball a lot better. But with the endeavour and and the togetherness and the, and, and the sort of the, the shape in the second half was far far better and we looked at, we looked a lot more solid aside. And as you said, plenty of away trips recently, lots of clean sheets as well. It's now three consecutive clean sheets, but you'd be pleased to get back to the Brewfield on Saturday, a big game against Southport, who have won the last four and third in the league. Yeah, against my old mate Liam. You know, we always come up well against him. Uh, he's another top manager, who've been, been in the game a long time, and a good side, you know, they're, they're a handful, big handful. Uh, that's why it was important that we carried the run. You know, I know we haven't won the game, but it's certainly important that we kept a clean sheet and we've um, we've got we've got another point on the board, which is great. And like I said, not many teams will come here and get results. Um, so I'm really delighted with the performance of the lads um, because, like I said, it's um, it, it keeps that run going, keeps the momentum going, and and ready for Saturday for a big 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 day, hopefully.